My wife is my best friend. I think more important than anything else, you have to uh, be a friend. You have to, your wife should be, or your husband should really be your best friend. If you can't build that friendship, the romance aspect will fade. Uh, right now we have a, a driven world where we're trying to move ahead and, and be our own person and we're not willing to sacrifice to the marriage. And the marriage has to come first. Um, of course, Christ has to be in it as he sacrificed for his church. We need to be sacrificial in our marriages. Very simple. The other problem is communication. We're busy communicating with everybody else except our spouses. And uh, it's a problem today. Uh, we're on email, we're on Facebook, we're on this, we're on that, and we're communicating with everyone else but the person that's in the house with you. We've been married uh, uh, December the 20th of this year, will be 32 years. People don't stick to commitments. Um, when you take your wedding vows, I mean, you commit to uh, for better, for worse, for richer, for poor, and you actually make a covenant, and I think that most people don't understand what a covenant relationship is. That means that two parties agree, they come together, and they commit to making things work. First of all, we need to make sure that it's God's will, and that we are engaging in godliness. The Bible says godliness with contentment is great gain. And I believe that one of the reasons why that marriage is like it is, is because it's too easy, first of all, to get out. We've been married six years, dating me. So a lot of people in the church are currently in blended families right now. I think we've removed God out of a lot of the systems, our, our school systems, our court systems, and even from the family standpoint, a lot of families are, it's a fast paced moving world now. They don't sit down to eat anymore. They don't pray before meals. Um, rarely do you see the whole family at the church in one body. They're either off in separate parts of the church even. The foundation of marriage is based on a three court strand and a lot of families are living a one or two court strand. Um, you know, with a three court strand, it's you, your wife, and God. As it makes up the strand, it's not easily broken.